Hey guys, Double Alert Angel here. Welcome to my channel and to my new series RSP, reviewing specific products. Now, a disclaimer right in the beginning of this video. I am not a tech channel, so I won't be reviewing that of them products, but every every now and then if there comes something interesting that would be in beneficial for uh, photo manipulation for both artists and professionals how to spice up or help things out in when we make our art so let's get right to it Okay guys, so the first product that I will review is from Huion and this video is not sponsored by Huion but I have used their products for years anyway. The first product that I'm gonna review today is this small pen and tablet uh, called Inspiroy H420X. So let's get right to it. So anyway, let's let's start checking the the specs so the working area is 106 times 66 millimeters the resolution is 5080 lpi lpi stands for uh, lines per inch and levels of pressure sensitivity so the sensitivity of the actual pen is 8192 it uses usb-c and and uh this tablet has just less than 300 pps uh, points per second normally uh, i think tablets are in 200 points per second so let's open this baby up anyway let's see so first we have the tablet yeah you on tablet so super small and very light and here's the outlet for the usb-c then we have the pen and the USB-C cable. Extra nibs, that's very good. And here is the quick start manual. And then we have these two adapters, one from micro USB and uh, USB to USB-C. Sure, why not? That's everything in the box. Let's take a look at the pen. The stylus, it's battery free, very light feels good in the hand uh, it, it has this rubber holding over here with where the where you have your fingers um, I have my own stylus for my uh, canvas 20 pro and uh, here we have the comparison well a little smaller maybe and it, it doesn't weigh as much but otherwise quite similar it should be quite easy just to plug and play and one good thing about this uh, that I won't be doing today, but you can use these tablets on your phone. Okay guys, so this metal thing is actually a nib remover. Like this, you remove the nib. So as you can see, the area is quite small, but it works right away. It's crazy fast. <laughs> I'm gonna check my Huion program and see if I can change anything in it. So the Huion tablet program can be downloaded from huion.com. It looks like this and it already recognizes our Inspiroy. I have my canvas here also, but let's keep it in this one. Here we have the working area. So for what it is working with and uh, for now we're gonna use this display that I'm working on right now. And uh, the digital pen you can change the pressure and sensitivity as you please. The yellow dot is adjusts the pressure and the red dot adjusts the sensitivity. Uh, custom that I like to make. So, so full area, the full area of working space is inside this rectangle here. So if you're outside this rectangle, it, it won't recognize your mouse that's good to know that's actually how every one of these works let's see if it it matters in what direction i have this one so let's turn it around you can basically have this tablet in any way you like and it understands your working area so let's keep it this way so 
let's jump into Photoshop and check how this works. So we, we know that it recognizes like a mouse cursor, right? So that's the first thing, but let's make a new layer and uh, try the pressure sensitivity. So I, I have a normal brush, let's make it black, add pressure sensitivity and we can use this basically as a normal tablet. Yup. Anyway, so now when we dabbled a little with this one and know that it it works as it should, we're gonna make an artwork, right, with this one. So next up, I'm gonna make an artwork with this tablet. In in a time lapse, I decided that I chose um, Attack on Titan, my favorite anime. I am gonna test with this tablet to first of all use the pen tool in normal situations and also as brushing but we will make a, this in a time lapse so let's go to the voiceover and uh, I will start making this art so enjoy! Okay guys so I have to say none of this artwork would have been uh, possible without the fantastic cosplayer Narga uh, live stream or Narga cosplay on Instagram. You can find her there and also on Deviant Art. And uh, I really hope she appreciates this one. And anyway, uh, I also did use Envato Elements as uh, stock footage, but then I also found this jumpsuit of uh, the female Titan that well, it's 2D, so I started to pick bits and pieces and uh, make my own Titan. Using this tablet, using all kind of tools that you find in Photoshop to get her alive. Anyway, let's check this, the rest of this out without me talking. Okay, so guys, here we have my Attack on Titan fan art poster of Annie Lionheart. I would love uh, Yuion to sponsor me, <laughs> why wouldn't I? But this RSP video will be an honest uh, review. So, what I think about this Inspiroi H420X? Well, First of all, like this is my hand, so you can see it's quite small, so it's definitely not meant for a longer artwork. This artwork took about, I would say, three hours or so to make, and uh, I would probably have done it more refined if my hand was okay. My wrist actually, actually were quite sore and uh, pretty tired after this one. The pen is 
super awesome. It's lightweight, but it has a little weight in it, so, so it feels good in your hand. This rubber part of the pen is also comfortable for your hand. Uh, the tablet is very accurate and and 300 pixels per second is probably pretty accurate. It's closer to 300 than 200, that's for sure. I never had problems with the pen tool, for example. What I would love this to have is like, it should be actually a little bigger. I understand that this is the smallest one, but still it should be maybe like two centimeters bigger in the edges. It, the, the area where it works does not need to be bigger, but the actual hand rest would be a nice thing. Also that it had like two buttons on any of the sides, like for example on this side where the cord comes in, uh, that you could put macros on and for example add a zoom view feature because I was all the time uh, missing a zoom feature and I needed to put down the pen and take the mouse and zoom with that. Anyway guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this type of video. I will do more of these, but uh, not in a while. Uh, I also hope you like my artwork. It became pretty cool. Uh, refinements could have been better. And also thank you Narga Livestream for the awesome pics of Annie Lionheart. If you ever will see this video, I don't know. And um, I will put the link for this Inspiroi in the description below. Uh, if you like to edit stuff on your Android phone, this tablet is probably a great way to go. Anyway, I'm Double Art Angel. Thanks for watching. I'll catch you in the next one.